Shay, g'day folks, and welcome to my next episode of Skybox Survival here on Talibrex Ultimate Skybox Server. This is awesome. So I've done a little bit AFK, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit. Okay, so I've been growing some trees, just a couple, just a couple. Um, I've also been able to get a little bit more of the dirt from underneath. Uh, to make this squarer and I have also been smelting some cobble because let's go down here shall we ah ha ha tricky dicky here we go uh, bedrock level here is usually where I really do like to start my floor my base of my sky block so uh, bedrock level I've been smelting to make the stone bricks, um, there is a reason behind that and I will let you know. So this is the start of something beautiful. Um, this episode here, we're going to uh, start our farm, I think it is. I think we're going to start going with our farm. Um, but there's also another little something something that I was wanting to talk to you guys about as far as what's available on this server. Uh, what do I have in? I do have. See, look at this. I have a, that, that will come into play. Now I need a sword. We all know how to make swords. I actually also need to get rid of some of my inventory, so I'm just going to make a chest. I'll be back in a sec. Okay, so double chest there. Success. Uh, we've got the trees going. Blah blah blah. I have my sword. Now with this server here, when you think you're in need of something like, say, bone meal, for example. There's plenty of ways you can go about doing that. My personal preference, and I'll show you what I've got here. See this bottom row, uh, rotten flesh, ignore that, but I've got some bottle of enchanting, blah, 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 blah. You can get all of these from the dungeons. So what I've gone ahead and done is I've made a sword, uh, and I'm going to take you to one of the dungeons. Now, I'm not going to get all the way through it, because I just don't. <laughs> I'm not very good, but when you're in need of a little bit of XP, or maybe you need some rotten flesh to feed your doggy, or you need some bone meal, or you want to make a potion so you need some spider eye, whatever you need for mob drops, one of the best things to do is to come into the dungeon hub and, um, and head through one of the dungeons. So this is the pirate dungeon here. Now the reason, I was, I'm actually glad I'm doing this, the reason that I am using Faithful Hello, Mr. Creeper. Is because this dungeon and one of the other ones has actually got an inbuilt specific texture pack. Click me for texture pack. Now, I've already done that. Let me just make sure I'm safe. So, I will transfer from Faithful into the um, custom texture pack for this dungeon. Isn't that so much creepier? That's, oh, and the creepers look like they're like really overweight. They, they look, they actually, yeah, no, I'm not going to say what they look like. Um, but, now what is it ahead? This, this stone here, I'm pretty sure is like obsidian, maybe, and they've made it all volcanic and gross and stuff. No creeper. You'll see me do a, do a quick slash IH to get back to my island home. My island home. No! Um, when I'm... Oh god, I'm about to die anyway. Are they coming at me, bro? Yes. Yes, they are. Okay. Okay. No. Oh, damn it, damn it, damn it. There I go. <laughs> so, yeah, that's the general gist of... Oh, raining. Of the, um... Of the dungeons. Okay, now let's get on with business, shall we? Uh, as I did tell you while I was away, um, I was making some stone, so I might actually do a little bit more. But what it comes down to is having to make charcoal as well. So we'll kill a few birds with one stone. Let me just put my torches there, because that's where I like them. I can't believe I made a sword and I already had one. Duh. Uh, there we go. Is there anything else I need? No. Uh, so let us, first of all, make... Dang it. Make some charcoal. And I'll go down, because I've got quite a bit of stone brick slabs anyway. Uh, and we'll start expanding out this area. 
Okie dokie, so I've been busily smelting and mining and doing and stuffing and this thing and that thing. Uh, and I've got like a, it's a, 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 a 8, 16, 17 by 17 block down here that's a good start. It's a good start, nice and central. Um, so I think it's definitely time to go face forward and start thinking about things like the... Um, never-ending water supply, etc, etc. Now, I do want this to be pretty. I want it to be pretty and I want it to be symmetrical as well. I've got a huge, huge um, love of symmetry. I do love it very much. So much so. Uh, and so, the fact that wood is a really easy resource, and it's not ugly, um, I think I'm going to go for wood for a few bits and pieces like this. I'm also going to bring the uh, the cobblestone generator down to this level as well. It's a bit jerky, isn't it? My mouse has been a bit funny. Um, so let's just go and get the... Um, whoo, let's miss the water completely. What I'll need here is the second block of ice um, that they gave me. I will need the bucket, uh, hence to steal the water from here. Uh, so I'm going to have to do a bit of a... Well, oh, uh, no, I'm going to have to do this. I-H. Ha ha. TP'd myself back up there. That was, um... Yeah, I didn't think that one through, did I? So I've got the ice and I've got the... Oh, dang it. No, that's not going to work. Dang. Hang on, I could probably just go over the edge, can't I? Yes. Yes, you can, Carrot. Um, okay, so place the block in there. Boom. Place the water on the opposite side. And there we go. The never-ending water supply. Now let's just go back on the top level again. Pop the water back in the cobblestone generator just for now because um, that was a bit silly. And I lost my... There it is. Ha! Ah, I lost the uh, sugar cane from doing that as well. It was a bit silly. Let's just get rid of this last tree because we're going to start bringing everything down to the next level. Beautiful, beautiful. I've got loads of saplings, so if I lose any from this one, from not being on this level, I'm not fussed. I'm not fussed at all. Got loads of wood here, so yep, I reckon. Let's organise a cobblestone generator. Now, how many blocks did I leave? I left two. So if I make this level with that one and leave two, let's do a cobblestone generator here. And there we have it. So I do have a natural looking never ending water supply here, which will probably get moved eventually. Um, but that's, I'm kind of glad I've made it out of wood because it does make it easier. And our cobblestone generator. Oh, that's irritating, isn't it? Losing that one. The first one. The cobblestone generator there. Oh my gosh. The wood is cursed. Um, has been moved down as well. So, there's only one last thing to do before I go. This isn't going to be the kind of series, I think, where I'm going to be able to complete a challenge every single episode. It just won't be possible because as, as it gets on in the episodes, the challenges get more difficult. Uh, and so uh, you'd end up watching a 50-minute episode just to catch two fish or something like that but while I was growing these oaks here I have been able to catch the apples and apple collector is one of the challenges so let's at least go ahead and collect that because then I can get some more saplings and there they are so two jungle we've got two birch and two spruce and another two was added to the oak um, I'll just show you here as well um, as you saw it was two apples to get apple collector but if you want to do it so many times in a row the requirements are more you can see now just under the yellow bit the, the in the white it says three apples are required to do it uh, but it resets back to its original two or whatever see like the cobblestone is there 66 instead of 64 um, in the certain amount of hours some is only a couple of hours some's up to 24 and I'm guessing as the challenges get harder it, it could be like 48 even longer than that so Thank you once again for joining me here on Talibrex Ultimate Skyblock Survival Server thingy, doozy what's it and stuff and, and bits. Uh, I hope you have enjoyed it. Remember to leave a like down below. Any comments, uh, any questions, any other games you want me to play. And last but not least, say good day to your neighbour.